first measure that we're going to sign is House Joint Resolution 100. It honors the aerospace and aviation products manufacturing industry upon becoming the top exporting industry in the Commonwealth. And so this resolution, which is sponsored by Representative Atkins and others, number one, honors Kentucky for its aerospace industry, but more important than that, it is going to institute a study of what all we do, how we do it, and how we can grow it, how we can make it even bigger. Right now it's a, what, a $7.8 billion export for Kentucky per year that we're going to, to sign is House Bill 232. And that also is going to be helping Kentucky train the next generation of space scientists. Back in 2014, the General Assembly created the Craft Academy for Excellence in Science and Mathematics. That's going to be opening this coming August. And it's going to be opening right here at Morehead State University. This is going to allow exceptional high school juniors and seniors across the state to attend a boarding school type academy here in Moorhead. This is modeled after the Gatton Academy on the campus of Western Kentucky University. Folks, in the last three years, the Gatton Academy has been chosen by several publications as the number one high school in the whole country. At this academy, students will earn dual high school and college credit, allowing them to graduate from high school with up to 60 hours of college course credit. It permits the Craft Academy, this bill does, to be considered as an eligible high school for keys reporting purposes and to allow the academy to issue diplomas. Then I want to hear from Dr. Carol Christian, the director of the Craft Academy. Governor Brashear, President Andrews, and distinguished guests. This is truly a historic day for the Craft Academy at Moorhead State University. I promise you that the Craft Academy will be the, pre, the premier program in Kentucky that makes a difference upon Kentucky. We are proud to have the first class with us today to witness the signing, and uh, we appreciate it very much. 